Welcome to Two Script Tales on the red carpet here at the Nova Cinema in Carlton for the opening of the much waited, the much waited for Speed is Expensive movie. And here we have one of the stars of the show, John Errett. John, welcome to Two Script Tales. Thank you very much. It's good to be here. We only flew down this morning. All right. So tell us, why does a young lady have an interest in Vincent's? Why are you interested in Vincent's? Um, so my dad and my uncle Ken, they build Irving Vincent's. So I've, I've grown up around the track, um, been up around the pits. It, it's all I know. It's all I do on the weekends. And we've got um, fast charging Barry Horner, one of the creators of the Irving Vincent and Vincent Royalty herself, Edith Irving, welcome to Twist Grip Tales. Thank you. Thanks, Bruce. Yeah. And we, we know that you're a hard-charging rider of the Irving Vincent. Yeah, I, I, I ride the three-wheeler most of the time, yes. Um, a frightening thing, it is. <laughs> Edith has been on the back with me, actually. On the side car, yeah. I was terrified. Yeah. Good morning, Ken. Good morning, how are you? Good. You're here to see the movie, Speed Absolute, is Expensive? Absolutely. Absolutely. And what are your expectations? I expect to hear about one of the greatest motorcycle um, inventors of all time. In fact, two of them. Two films. That's it. So, um, so that's a great accent you've got there. Yes. I'd like to say I flew all the way from Ireland just to see the movie, but not quite true. It's not quite true. Well, Kona Satatu. Kamegama. Kahanawa. <laughs> Top of the morning. Wonderful day. It's going to be a great day, and what are your expectations of this wonderful movie? I'm interested very, very much. A bit of history that we don't hear about. Hopefully we'll learn something. And maybe we will. You enjoy the movie. Thank you very much. Good on you. Good morning. Good morning. Off to see the movie? Yes. And what are your expectations, young man? I'm not sure. <laughs> do you own a I Vincent? Have, I have it open. Yes, I do. There you go. What sort? Uh, 1950 model. All oh, right. Yeah. So, uh, and you, you love your Vincent. Yes. As you do. Yes. That's great. Well, we'll see if we can love the film. We'll uh, find yeah. out what it's like. It's a world premiere. Yes. It, yes, it should be very good. Enjoy. Well, thank you. Everybody's moving in now. Let's go and have a look at this movie. Sneakers on his feet, probably the most famous motorcycle photograph ever. During the 1940s and 50s, Vincent set more speed records than any other manufacturer. It proved that the Vincent motorcycle was the work of a genius. What is it about motorcycle riding? What, what's the attraction? Um, I don't know, I think I feel closer to nature. <laughs> um, I was listening to a, a comedy sketch the other day about someone describing the very first motorcycle, how it had absolutely no protection on it, you were exposed to the elements, um, and it was really all about you not destroying yourself. But um, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't probably swap it. I'll, I'll, I'll have a bike till you know, the end of my life, that's for sure. Um, it's, it's something that I've had since I was 12 and that's not going to change. Mm. I don't know, it's just, it's just, I don't know, how do you tell a happy motorcyclist by the, all the bugs in his teeth? You know, it's, just, <laughs> it's, just, it's just a lot of fun to ride. Gareth, we've seen the movie Speed is Expensive. What were your thoughts? Um, very amazing, very amazing uh, movie. Uh, didn't realise how much intense that type of motorbike was. Um, you hear about him. 
Uh, it's sad you don't see enough of them. Um, all new motorbikes these days, you see them a lot, but the older motorbikes you don't see. Getting very expensive, as we know now. Now um, this is the world premiere. You've come all the way from Wales to see the uh, premiere this I morning. Wish, wish I was. I'm only in um, Greenwood North. <laughs> oh, okay. That's right. So have you got a Vincent? No, I haven't got a Vincent. No, not, not yet. Can't, can't, can't afford one of them. Can't afford one of them. All right. Well, thank you. You have a great day, thank and you uh, glad you enjoyed the movie. Thank you very much. Well, John, thank you for your uh, post-movie um, interview at the end there, questions and answers. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, so what were your thoughts of the movie? Well, I thought it was great. Um, I got a lot of detail that I had missing before. I mean, uh, I had snippets of it from when David was out here uh, about who they'd spoken to, John and Marty and Jay Leno, and um, it just it filled in all those gaps and things like that. It was really good. It was... Um, it was interesting to see photographs of my mum and dad. Uh, I've got those original photographs at home, but I haven't seen them for quite some time, so it was, it was nice to see them, yeah. Not a problem. Lachlan, are you ready to go? We're rolling. Edith, what did you think of the movie? I thought, I was very impressed. Yes, I have seen it before. I saw it in Tasmania. So. Oh, you had a sneak preview. <laughs> yes. Well, as uh, motorcycling Vincent royalty, I'm not surprised. Ken Horner, you've seen the movie. It's now uh, no longer a premiere. It's now in general uh, distribution. So what are your thoughts on it? Oh, it's very good. I did see the premiere in London um, 12 months ago. So this is my second viewing of it. And um, we're probably, um, you know, a year's gone by pretty quick, but we're hoping it'd get to here sooner. But um, it needs to be seen, and they've done a very good job. Yibbity yibbity, that's all, folks. The movie has now been premiered, and uh, what a great movie, what a great story, what a great bike, what great people have come here. Uh, Edith, John, the Horners, and uh, so many others to enjoy this, the world premiere. So check it out in your cinema. Uh, get yourself a Vincent. That's all I can say. Thanks. Have a great weekend.